Dr. Tucker and Dan Davis. Both of these gentlemen have worked with Valdosta City and Lowndes County Schools for many years. They both chaired the Community Partners in Education. We appreciate their support. Thank you all for being here tonight. I was, I was <laughs> Too late, Lynn. You told me not to cheerlead, but you get, I got the mic in my hand, and I don't have the right to vote. But I'm encouraging everybody to vote no. I have friends in the city. Call them, tell them to vote no. This is too important an issue to our community. Not to leave a cheer. And as Lynn stated, I work both school systems. And folks, they don't get any better than what we have. I work with other school systems. I see other school systems around the state, around the southeast. I haven't found one yet. And doesn't brag on what we have here. I work with other communities around the southeast. I haven't seen one yet that aren't jealous of what we do. Now, how in the world? Just a question. Somebody spoke to me about business. Think we don't have what it takes to compete. Somebody make a statement. And I'm an old country boy. My granddaddy told me the things you said is the truth or a lie. Things I say this morning, this afternoon, is what I've experienced. I don't know of a community anywhere. And I think, not good, real good at geography, but I believe San Diego is about as far as you can walk from here. And they brag on our school systems at a national meeting. It had nothing to do with education. It was business. And they know about our school systems. They ask about it. A little bit about why I'm here. I challenge anybody to have been as involved, as consistently, and as long as I have in business and community development in and around Bellows and Lyons County. I've served as chairman of the Industrial Authority, served as chairman of the Tourism Authority, I've served as chairman of the Dallas Technical Board of Education, I've been on the Superintendent of the Council School, member of CPIE since its inception. I challenge anyone, and even today, I'm still involved with economic development across the region, across several states, not just Georgia, Florida, Alabama, South Carolina, Tennessee. Folks, the truth is, I have never, never been asked whether I've got one system or two. Never. I have never asked anyone whether I have one, whether they have one system or two. Now, where did that come from? Now, I'm ready to state that while I served on the industrial floor, I cannot think of one business we lost because we had two systems. Now, why is it that we cannot recruit businesses? Folks, I have been involved with both school systems. Extensively, I worked to get the technology program at Valles High School in the credit. I'm not afraid to go in Valles High School. I've been in every school in both systems. Numerous times. And I promise you there's not a principal or a coordinator in either system that have called and I've not responded. I'm not afraid of anyone. I know exactly what they do and how they go about doing it. In our state category, there is no improvement of consolidating these school systems. And I'll ask the question again, where in the world did the Chamber of Commerce get them? 
Oh, by the way, I've served on the board of directors of Chambers of Commerce. But one thing, I didn't give up my backbone. So I went there long. I don't rubber stamp things. And I do have the ability to think. You don't tell me anything. Nobody. What I have experienced, you can't tell me any different. Community partners in education. 